Don't drop it, Kerry. <laughs> As far as we know, this is the first time radar has ever been used to locate archaeology on a riverbed. And there's good reason. No one else would be daft enough to stick 30,000 quids worth of equipment into an inflatable dinghy. I tell you what, you're glad you can't see yourselves from this angle. <laughs> so not enough rings on this one either. Over in the incident room, the struggle to date our bridges is fast becoming a soap opera. This one we actually found late last night, and mm. basically it has, it has more than 50 rings. It's actually got 67 rings. Have in you it. got a tape for it? No. <laughs> oh, why not? Well, if you look at here, look yeah. on, the, on the screen here, yeah. and you can see here in the Roman period, I'm just getting nothing. Hang on, so th these are the dates, so that's 471, so you've got two there. Yeah. Then nothing else in the Roman. But look, you've got uh, loads at 1104. Could it be Norman? No, because I know the data really well, though, and that just isn't jumping out enough at me. So what are we going to do? Keep looking. Keep diving, keep getting wet. While we were just filming that scene, Mick's Blackberry was beeping, but we ignored it. And then, after we finished shooting, Mick had a look at the message, and it said, we have a result. And the message was from the laboratory that Mick uses in order to have another run at the data uh, to see whether they can get a result. You're covering something up with a piece of paper, Mick. Have we got a result? No. Well, we do, but I'm not going to tell you. Why? Because I am a bit... I don't believe it. Come on, let's no, have a No, I, I don't believe the date myself, and because I don't believe the date, I'm not going to tell you what it is. You genuinely aren't going to tell me? I'm not going to tell you. I want to check and check and check until I'm 100% sure it's right. Oh, this is ridiculous. <laughs> it's not ridiculous, because if I tell you the date and I come back tomorrow and decide it's not right, I'm going to look like a fool. So we I'm all look like fools on time scene. It doesn't matter. Will you tell me tomorrow? If I think it's correct, I will tell you tomorrow. <sighs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Back in the river, we're still messing about in boats. But Ratty, Mole and Badger may have pulled off a minor miracle. Yeah. I think as we went over the bridge, there might have been... I mean, when you could feel the wood under your feet, there was a very different response on the screen, so it might have worked. It's been another storming day. We've got archaeology coming at us from all sides, even if we still can't make sense of it yet. What's really gratifying is that all our painstaking detective work is beginning to pay off. We're on a roll. Hello, my name's John Gator. Time Team is fan-funded by Patreon. This vital support helps us to make new episodes. Joining Patreon gives you access to exclusive interviews, 3D models and masterclasses, plus lots more.